Hi BDs, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. And today I have another review for you. I have lots of reviews for you. <laughs> um, this review is another Pantene product. Um, this is from the company, or it's sent to me from Expo, which is a, um, like a company like where you do the um, surveys and if you qualify, they will send you the products. You'll get an email and it will usually say take this survey and then they just you know let you know if you did qualify or if you were chosen for the um to get the products and that so i've done several of them already with expo i've done um a couple with uh, i'm trying to think of some of the other names right now the other ones and i can't right now for buzz agent or something like that so there's several ones out there and expo is one so i will put the link down below and you can go and check them out and anybody can do you know, do these kind of reviews and everything and try products out or items or anything. It doesn't have to even be beauty, it could be whatever that they're doing at that moment. Uh, cleaning products, um, you know, personal items or something. So this product here is the, um, they gave me two, they're like the little, these little small ones. I was trying to find the price for, because I don't know if they sell them like this, because this is on the go. Uh, Pantene blowout extend dry shampoo and these are like a small one it's like 1.7 ounce and the bigger ones are like a four point something uh, it's $6.99 for the bigger size so I'm not sure if they sell these like this I'm not quite really sure but um, so anyway uh, I have tried dry shampoo in the past and um, so far I just haven't been to excited about dry shampoo. Um, now, I was just looking on the site and I found some interesting little tips and I thought maybe I'll give those tips a try too. Um, so let's go on with this product, okay? So um, it's a dry shampoo. I might have to look on the site part real quick. Hopefully, okay, yeah, the light's still on. So this is Blowout Extended Dry Shampoo. Uh, it says it extends the style even on the second day. You want to keep up with the runway ready style and a, a little bit longer. Uh, their new waterless formula helps extend the blowout, giving your style a fresh, clean look even on the second day. So it's pretty much for second day, which um, honestly, like for me, when I do use the dry shampoos, and maybe this is why I have the problems, I usually don't do the second day, I do the third day because. I like to wash my hair a couple times in a week and in between I like to do a condition and, and them kind of things like I don't wash my hair every single day I don't wash it every other day I will let a couple days go by so I do it twice within a week um, I just find it to be more better and healthier for your hair and not so much breakage and all that kind of stuff uh, but when I'm looking on here it does say um, where was it at now? Um, I was trying to find. There's their top stylist recommends targeting oily areas first. Uh, try Pantene Smooth Serum and Argan Oil on the ends for a refinished look. So, uh, not necessarily have to get Pantene. Maybe if another company makes one, you can get. But um. Well, let's see. The exclusive Pro-V formula with natural tapioca absorbs oil and gives you instantly refreshed hair without washing. So you want to shake it, lift, and then it says spray, and then comb. Shake vigorously before use in between sprays. Part and lift sections on of dry hair and spray a scalp or wherever refreshment is needed most. Massage through the, through thoroughly with fingertips. If excess powder appears, easily remove with the swipe of a brush. Um, so that was one of the problems I would have with some dry shampoos because, like, my hair is dark, and a lot of times I would look like, oh my god, I I, I do have sometimes a hard time, or I I have had times with dry scalp, and I will get like kind of some dandruff and stuff. But my gosh, when I would use the dry shampoo, it was ridiculous. I mean, it was like. There was times I'd try to use a dry shampoo lightly and everything. 
So when they sent me this, I thought, okay, I'll give it a try, you know, because I'm willing to try, like I said, anything, you know, even with dry shampoo, I, I would still try other dry shampoos. With this one here, I do like the scent. The scent is very lovely, very nice. Um, I do have to say I didn't notice, I didn't notice the white dandruffy kind of thing that I was describing. Um, or anything like that. I will say I didn't notice that. Um, my hair wasn't too bad. Um, but I don't think it's something I'm going to go out and purchase because it's still, I'm still not feeling the whole dry shampoo thing right now. I'm still not finding something that I guess I'm hoping, because like with some, I mean, it could be me. It could be my error and it might not even be the product. But I'm just finding with myself when I'm putting these dry shampoos in my hair a lot of times, and I am trying to do pretty much of what they're saying to do, you know, like I, I do go by a lot of the stuff that they go by. Um, but sometimes after a while, I will find my hair to seem, do I want to, I don't know if I want to say sticky a little bit or something you know and then I'll like I will brush through my hair I don't know I'm just not sure <laughs> it's like I'm just not feeling it yet um, but if you're somebody who who loves dry shampoos and you haven't tried this one I would say give it a try if you do have dark hair like me I didn't find it to do to, to do uh, a dandruff kind of thing on me like some have I mean I have tried two other ones and this will be my third dry shampoo to try uh, so, granted, I haven't tried every single dry shampoo. There could be that one out there that might be for me. I don't know. Or just dry shampoo is just not for me. It might not be. Um, but I would say give it a try because I do think the scent's very lovely. And I didn't find the dandruff um, part or anything like that. And again, like I said, it could be human error. It could be me. It might not even be this itself. I could be still doing something wrong and not realize it. I could try what it said in there to put a little kind of a serum and um, some argan oil and, and try some of those kind of things too. Um, so yeah, I could probably play with it. Um, but again, it's $6.99 for the bigger product, whether they sell these on-the-go ones. I'm going to guess probably because, um, you know, that's probably the one great thing too if you can get the on-the-go ones. I'm not sure how much they would be. but. Um, the great thing about these would be you could put it in your purse and if you're at work and um, you know maybe you're gonna go out with your friends or catch up on your date and stuff and you want to refresh your hair I mean like you know just spritz it in refresh your hair and there you go um, just with anything uh, maybe you're at the gym same thing after you're done you know whatever with the gym and then you're gonna go out somewhere afterwards you get your shower and you know what I really get into doing your whole hair thing and blow drying your hair and you just want to get in the shower wash off and then take this and whatever so I think that's a pretty neat idea to have a smaller can and it's so convenient you know vacation whatever so um, I would say give it a try for me I won't probably more or less I won't purchase because um, I don't want to I can't see me spending the money on it if it's something I'm not going to really still find to enjoy but I do think it's I think it's a great concept. I think it's a great idea of this whole dry shampoo. Like I think it's it would be it would be great, but I just haven't found the one for me yet. So, um, but it could be the one for you. And Pantene is a well-known brand out there. I'm not knocking it. It's just didn't do. It's still I still haven't found that. Uh, you know, there's just something I'm not whatever with it yet. But um, I do think the scent's wonderful. And again, like I said with having dark hair, I didn't notice the dandruff thing where I did with the other two. Um, it was like after I sprayed it, I did. So that part I would say is a plus with this for me when I did use it. Um, so I'll, I'll go through it and I'll use it still here and there. It's not that I won't, but to purchase it, I probably, I probably won't go out and purchase it. Um, there's a couple other ones I might try of a dry shampoo, but so yeah. I hope that was helpful for, for you beauties out there. Like I said, it could be for you. Just because it's not for me does not mean it's not for you. So I would say go ahead and give it a 
try and see what it does for your hair. It might be your holy grail for all you know. So, alright beauties, um, if you liked this video, please give it a good thumbs up. And also, if you're not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you. So go ahead and click the subscribe button. And as always, beauties, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. Until the next time, I will talk to you then, and y'all take care. Bye-bye.